Lukeria went viral. In the video, local police officials can be seen manhandling those who are offering namaz on the streets. Following this, tensions escalated in the area. People who are praying, is this right? Now, this is the situation the Ummah is in. And this is why we've been reiterating the hadith of Thawban again and again. Be upright towards Quraysh, i.e. your rulers and leaders, as long as they are with you. And if you're not, put your swords on your back and eliminate them, annihilate them. And if you do not, then you'll be eating from the toils of your own hands as miserable farmers. This is the hadith and the prophecy of Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam that has been fulfilled clearly. Evidently from Iraq to Iran, from Morocco to Egypt, from Yemen to Pakistan. The Ummah is in humiliation, unfortunately, and it needs to change. When it comes to our own so-called Muslim rulers who take our rights, humiliate us, treat us unfairly, treat us unjustly, violate the divine religion, we are told to be patient, we are told to leave the affairs to the next life and we'll get rewarded for the misery and humiliation we go through. But when non-Muslims do it, you do not accept it and you shouldn't accept it. Because this is what the intellect, the heart in, br brings. The intellect, the mind... The soul cannot accept such tyranny. In fact, instead, we're supposed to enjoy good, forbid evil, call cool towards good wo words, call cool towards akhlaq, morality, ethics. And if not, we will get our rights by force. Hence why the hadith of Thawban, the one I just mentioned, says that if they do not treat you the way you should be treated and rule with the kitab of Allah and the sunnah of his triumphant prophet and messenger, then eliminate them. Why? Because they do not go, they do not go or change with good words. When you are being oppressed, killed, humiliated, and you cannot change with good words, you have to change with actions. That's what becomes obligatory. And this is self-evident.